Talk some other matters now. The dry season farming for 2023 and uh, 2024 has been flagged off in Benue State. Minister of Water Resources and Sanitation Joseph Utsiv, who was present at the flag off ceremony in Makudi, said government targets cultivating 500,000 hectares of irrigable land in 2024. Maya Wakmata reports and next will be business news. Call it a homecoming for the Minister of Water Resources and Sanitation, Joseph would say. And you may not be wrong, the Minister who is of chief descent is back in his home state in a major visit after his ministerial appointment months ago. Expectation from the Minister here as concerns basic needs are definitely high. As his native ruler, the Totiv, speaks the mind of his people, saying, let the water flow. We welcoming you i feel excited fulfilled god used me to give you an opportunity to showcase who you are and therefore with you in charge of water resources let the water flow the minister subsequently inaugurates a dam project which he hopes will tackle various social and economic challenges associated with unemployment, irrigation farming, power generation and water supply. Laboratories including a soil and geographic information system are also commissioned alongside the inspection of other facilities at the Lower Benue River Basin Development Authority. The minister also observes that the 1,500 hectares farm in the Mbaku community belonging to the Lower Benue River Basin Development Authority is inadequate for irrigation farming in 2024. We are commissioning this lesser dam for irrigation, basically. Water supply, among other purposes. And this dam, when put into maximum use, will be used for the irrigation. I'm calling on Benue State Government. I'm calling on Nasarawa State, Plateau State, and part of Kogi, that forms the Lower Benue River Basin Development Authority to use this opportunity and maximize their potentials, improve their economy, create jobs for the teaming population. Farmers and other beneficiaries were as well given water pumps and imputes. Mayowa Okwato, TVC News, Makodi.